hi guys and welcome back to my channel i just bought the new crystal creation stuff pack now this is the sim that i made if you watched my last video i made a witchy retail business for my sims for the new pack now this is a sim that will be running it her name is valerie and i figured today i could like just show off some of the stuff on a already made sim instead of making a whole new one um so that's what i'm going to do now couldn't find it at first so i'm sure you guys have probably seen other people's cast overviews i am just going to look at some of the stuff myself because seeing it on you know like a tv or anything you know i need to see it with my own eyes <laughs> so here i am here is one of the first hairs and i think this hair does really well on her actually um when i watched this hair like is it like clipping with some it's probably messing with something that i already have on her so if you see like weird stuff start to happen just know that this sim has a lot of cc on so things could start you know like messing with you know anything else is nothing of the sims fault it's just my sim just contains pretty much all cc so i do like this hair i don't know I, i'm always like iffy with like other hair colors and this usually when i use the clay hair i just go straight to the black shades or sometimes the red shades because they look more of a true red than what a lot of cc creators give they either give like a really like faded red hair dye or it's like way too like it's just always too light um but i think the colors for this like hairstyle in general look really good and then here you have the ombre one which i do like this one actually i feel like let's see i do wish this was a black into uh like a forest green but that's okay this black and red one is probably really great and matches my sim the most i'm gonna try not to make this too long okay so when i saw this it does have a detail in the back which i really like um this i do like this hair though this one is my favorite it also has a gemstone in in the back which are like a gemstone like a little hair piece in the back um yeah this one looks really good on my sim i really like this one i'm seeing that i'm not that's probably my cc clipping into it again it's okay and then you have this one which has like this detail in the back I typically don't see very many people put them in the back i see people put like a lot of hair clips up front or if they have strands of hair coming down they will put these rings like in those so i've never really seen it too much in the back but i do like this hair a lot and I think the men get this one and these two as well okay and for jewelry i'm seeing that we have this which i really do love these earrings um i cannot wait to have my sim make her own i like the different variations and then this necklace i know it's really hard to see i'm going to change her into a different let's see we'll just take these off of her for now okay now you can see the necklace now mind you it's most likely going to show up like this on a sim my sim has an overlay on which causes like the necklace to start getting wiggly <laughs> that's the best way i can describe it it just happens my sim is just completely custom content and yeah it's i know it's it would have been so much better if i had just made another sim but i'm not going to okay and for clothing we seem to have gotten this i was hoping that there would have been a plain swatch of this but i'm not seeing one and that's okay um i do like that it has the tuck in function because like i if, like i can wear it with like my cc stuff like this i do think it is a cool shirt it's not my favorite shirt that we've gotten but it is still really cool so I'll give them that. And then I'm going to keep this on. But well, we got a new skirt. And I do like this skirt a lot. Um, I like the colors. I like the little folds. Like the little pocket button folds. I like that they match. So that's really cute. It kind of can become a dress at this point. If you wanted to pretend that it was. And then for shoes. We got these. I know nobody likes these. I also don't like these. It's not the shoe. It's like the design. Like the pattern on here looks really cool. It's the way the heel looks. It's a kitten heel type thingy. I uh, The Sims. Uh, if I'm going to get a heel. I'm going to just wear custom content ones. I do think the idea was cool. Like this is really cool. But if we had just gotten this outside of the kitten heel. That would have been great. And these boots. They're cute. But they're not also not my favorite. Um. They would be really good for like a wintertime outfit category for sure. Um, I can see me putting these mainly on my rancher sims. That's kind of what it's giving me. More of like a western vibe. I don't know why. Um, so I can see me using these for like other sims. But definitely not like my regular sims i guess you could say and then for full body i love this dress so so much 
um when i saw this i was like i hope we get that dress this is probably my you would think that like a beige swatch would not be my favorite but that one and this green one like these green ones both of them the beige and green i don't know what it is i don't know if it's because we're going into spring but green is just i just love green so much so i'm really enjoying this dress a lot and then we have this one which kind of looks like something else we've gotten before but i'm not sure this would also um do really well with like a western or -er type sim maybe like a western gothic look i don't know but i do like this dress as well this one is kind of giving uh, I'm going to the family reunion or I'm just wearing it during, you know, I, I don't know. I, it's not my favorite, but the green color is really pretty. Like, I love the different tones of green. It's just not my favorite style of dress. It's giving clearance on the torrid rack I, I really don't know as a plus size person i feel like this is something a plus size like you would see in like the plus size section of a store um it's not my favorite um cute i mean maybe without this thing on it it would have been much cuter i'm just not a fan of this that's why i think that's why it's giving me clearance at, on like the torrid rack because it's like meshing something that's kind of like covering up the like the main thing i don't know it's just not my favorite and then we have this which looks really cool i really love this detail here um this is really cute i like it a lot um i'm not sure how many of my um sims will be wearing this i love the green as well I, this this one this dark green here this type of green like takes over my entire existence I love that shade of green. I love really deep emerald shades of green. So yeah, I really like that. And I didn't check to see if we had any, um, yeah, we do. Okay. So we have the ring over here, which I think is really cute. Um, I know they were putting out jewelry like on the sim shop. I'm not sure when it will be up, but I just know that they were. I love that we have this type of ring. It's really pretty. Um, I, the thing is, though, is I typically don't really wear too many rings in The Sims just for the fact that sometimes I like to use those eyelashes in the skin detail. If you have them, then you know for CC. Like, it, like, makes, like, this weird, like, texture on their, like, eyelashes. I don't get it. I don't know why it happens. Also, we have these, like, leg warmers. The green swatch and the red swatch. Probably my favorite. Um, I don't know if I will use these ever. I'm really not sure. The pattern isn't my absolute favorite. So, um, yeah, probably won't be wearing those. So I'm going to go get a male sim really quickly so we can quickly look at that. But that is just the cast portion. Um, I definitely gave her a new one because we are deleting that. This is how my sim looks. Um, I definitely prefer her like this. I don't think I'm going to be giving her anything from the new pack. I think I'm going to leave her the way I made her. Look at these shoes. Absolutely stunning. Um, let me go grab a male sim really quickly so we can do a quick overview of that. Okay, I grabbed a male. I just like gave him a little overlay, gave him a little facial hair, changed his eyes up, etc. So they do have the same hairs and they look really nice. This one doesn't have the little weird texture in the back. So you can actually see what the back of these look like without my custom content running into them. Um, he is clipping a little bit here, but that's probably because of the overlay. Um, so they basically just get the, you know, the same things. I'm going to keep him in this one gonna give him this swatch even though it doesn't match his facial hair at all of course they didn't get any new facial hair no new hats um they have the same earrings and then the same necklace um let's see i want to give him let's just the one she has we're gonna give him this gold one just because the gold looks cool um yeah nobody got anything um i can't show you him he is naggy hold on so this is one of the pants that they get so they get this sweater it is like a weird color cut for me um the thing about me is i have cc undershirts that can go up under here which will make you know this not seem as awkward to me um especially when my sims have chest hair i don't know if i'm gonna want all their chest hair just out and about um so yeah and i need him to like be quiet i have the standstill mod on but i don't think i have the original standstill mod on so it only applies to like the like face portion like accessories and stuff but i think this sweater is cool i just don't know if i'm a fan of the cut and then you have this like hoodie which i really like um that we have a hoodie because i feel like my i have a lot of cc ones but they always clip in with the pants so this could be a good alternative when i want to put them in one and then we have this i 
Don't know who's been designing clothes for The Sims recently, but whoever you are, I love that you're layering a lot of things. That is like my favorite thing that I have seen like in clothing lately in The Sims is the layering of all the clothes. It just seems so nice. I really do like this shirt a lot. Um, I love the, I just, it's just the layering and the details really nice. This would be a great shirt to use for a formal wear. I really, really like it. These pants are the only new pants that we got um, with this pack and that's why they are on him. They're not my favorite pants at all. Of course, um, men pants in The Sims are never my favorite. And then of course he got the ring as well. And then this other ring here, pretty much the exact same things. And then for shoes, they just have these boots now they look really cool like the men's ones do they look way better than the girl ones I don't know these would be really cool for my rancher sims as well my western sims I don't know what it is these are just better to me than the women's ones I don't know if it's because they have like that little shiny detail and stuff I don't know they just look really really nice I can see me putting my sims in this prom more than I would put the girl sims in theirs um honestly I would probably use like the girl boots could work on a men like on a male sim as well because they're just like they look like a unisex shoe to me these are probably the best shoes that we have gotten in the sims in a while besides the demonia looking shoes and the goth kit that recently came out now over here i made sure i checked over here i don't think i didn't see anything new up here but we do have a new aspiration which is a crystal crafter sim wants to cut gemstones craft jewelry and harness the power of crystals i am in um full edit mode so i'm going to change hers to that because that is what we're going to be doing in the sims um with this sim in general i wanted her to be a jewelry maker but that was the like cast portion um i wanted it to be more short and to the point so i hope you guys enjoyed let me know what you guys think of the cast portion of this pack i'm not like disappointed or anything i was mainly excited for this pack for the gameplay aspect of it because it is jewelry making and if you guys did not know i am a jewelry maker myself um my brand is wicked worn you can find us on tiktok shop and etsy i will link it below i always forget to link it below but um yeah that is my brand it's wicked worn i make like alternative and gothic jewelry so yeah if you guys ever want to check it out and that's why i bought this why i was excited about this so yeah i thank you guys so much for watching let me know in the comments below um what you think of the create a sim portion of this pack if you're buying this pack have you bought this pack what your thoughts are on this pack um if you haven't watched my last video of me making the witchy shop um i am about to go use the build buy stuff in this pack to go you know redo the shop a little bit because I said it was subject to change but if you want to see like the main portion of the witchy shop because I won't be changing everything I'll only be changing some of it um with the new stuff so if you guys haven't gone and watched that please go do that thank you guys so much for watching this video and I will catch you guys on the next video